Hi, and you're very welcome again. You're here with Anne Walsh of the Excel Expert, where at the website you can download your free 25 best Excel shortcuts. And today we're going to look at the max function. And essentially what the max function does is that it identifies what is the highest value in a list. Right. So over here again I have my list prepared. And as always, I click where I want the answer to go. Make sure I'm on the Home tab. And if I go over to the right-hand side, you see where the auto sum is? And I just click on the little triangle beside the auto sum. Right. And then you see the fourth one down, it says Max. Click on Max. Right. And again, as always, you see you have the same structure, equals Max, C3 to C6. And all I need to do then at this point is press Enter. Now again, I just want to remind you about this very useful little feature called Autocomplete. So first of all, I'm just going to highlight my numbers here. And if you look down at the bottom here, you see there you have some of them are saying average, count and sum. Now you can also include max on this if you need to. And if max is not visible, I bring the mouse down to here, right click. Okay, and what I do then is that if I come up here about a third of the way up, and if I just click on maximum, a little tick will appear beside it. Click outside it again. And if you notice down here, I now have max in that list. And again, all I need to do to come back up here is just bring my mouse down to the bottom right hand corner, drag it across, and again it picks up the highest value in the list. Um, I hope you found this useful, and um, I look forward to meeting you again. And as always, there is an Excel file below this video where you, which you can download to actually practice this. Right. Take care, goodbye.